previously on the Pride of Edinburgh. So in the last episode we took on Aberdeen and we managed to force a 3-3 draw at Easter Road. Then we took on a strong command side and lost 3-1. For wrapping up the video with a comprehensive 3-0 Edinburgh Derby win against Hearts. In this episode we're going to take on Motherwell, Dundee and St Johnston. Edinburgh, home of royalty, culture and tradition. It's also home of two classic Scottish clubs, but there's only room for one of them. Welcome to the Pride of Edinburgh. So here we are with the first game of this video. It's a tough one, away clash against Motherwell. So a bit of an injury crisis going through the camp at the moment. Uh, the likes of Gray, McTomney, uh, Silvica, Stevenson, and now Josh Windass. Big injury to him. He's going to be out for six or seven months, so that's not good for our big signing of the season. But anyway, this is the starting lineup for the match against Motherwell. Marciano, Whittaker, Hanlon, Erkstrand, Ambrose, McGinn, McGow, Ajara, Barker, Swanson, and Murray up front. Stokes, uh, Hepburn Murphy, and Boyle, amongst others, on the bench. So our hosts go in with a 5-3-2 formation, or a 5-2-3, depends how you look at it. And this will be our first game since that impressive... Uh, performance against Hearts. Can we continue? It's a rainy day in Scotland. Well, shouldn't expect anything else really. Currently find ourselves three points behind Hearts in third place. That's the only spot I'm looking at right now. I'm not really concerned about the top two. Um, just need to get our noses in front of those guys. Swanson. Looks like he's fouled on the edge of the box but nothing given. Murray. Tabaga. McGinn. McGow, Barker loses it. Hanlon to Swanson. Overlap, Ambrose. Big header in the box, Barker. Makes the caper work. It's going to be a corner. McGow, eventually, it's cleared by Motherwell. So the injury crisis. Hang on. McGow. Hopefully, I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, Murray, again on the score sheet. Yes, beautiful corner. We're not going to look at it because we are running out of time. Just trying to. Do this quick, but yeah, the injury crisis has given me the chance to kind of stick with a formation and stick with some personnel, perhaps. You know, I was a oh, big save by Marcion because I spent the big bucks on uh, Windus. I was, I had to play him. I wanted to play him because I spent the money and his form really didn't justify. Here comes Swanson. Barker is back in the squad because of the injury, I'd say. Another corner. McGow. Murray was tackled there. And McHugh clears it for Motherwell. But yeah. I think a smaller squad does give us options. McGow clears it for Murray. Who's on fire at the moment. Ajara. Swanson off the post. Bolomenek. And Motherwell try to counter. But it amounts to nothing. Ambrose. Swanson. McGow. Of the top towards Murray. But Motherwell break. Here comes Tate. Tanner. Campbell. Hamill. Shot comes all over the place. A jar breaks. He's on his own. Murray though gets the ball now. Holds up play. Ambrose. And nothing amounts to that. Throw in for Hibbs. But Motherwell gets straight back. Campbell's got the ball now. To Tate. To Tanner. Campbell. Slips it in there. Good effort. But doesn't really make the keeper stretch. Celtic. Pissing all over there. Opponents 4-1 at the moment. It's not even half time. Malt with a shot, but it goes off a Hibbs defender for a throw in. And here is the resulting throw in. Headed clear by Hanlon. But it's not over. Now it's over for the time being. Yes, 4-1 Celtic lead over Kilmarnock. Hearts, I'm not too sure what they're doing. Are they even playing? No. Uh, what are we doing? What are we doing? Assertive, passionate. Happy with performance. Keep it going. We want some more of that. Maybe second goal would be great. Second half. Here come Hibs. I mean, uh, Motherwell even. Balls. That was a bad. Um, ooh, heavy tackle by Ambrose. Free kick for Hibs to the head of Erkstrand, but uh, doesn't really amount to anything. Motherwell now, though, with a free kick. 
eventually comes out and does pretty much nothing. Another effort for a free kick Hamill with his deadly left peg. Uh, makes it keep a stretch, but it goes over. So Celtic 5-1 now up. Aberdeen doing the business against Ross County. We're hanging on. We're hanging on. Free kick McGinn straight into the wall. Looks pretty worthless. 70 minutes played. What do we do? I want a second goal. Would be nice. Corner. There it is. That is perfect timing. Perfect timing. Uh, attacking three here. Fresh set of legs. We should have enough to uh, to hold on now. Really. Pressure's off Hepburn Murphy, so maybe he can, you know, uh, fry or play with freedom. I was going to say fly with freedom, but uh, yeah, it's a bit uh, Stokes to boil. Jara. Overlap for Ambrose. Well, I don't know what that was, but he gets it back. Boyle! With a looping effort. Um, but a good good away performance, I think, by Hibbs. It's, you know, we're not dominating possession, but we, we, we've, we've had more shots. And more shots on target, too. So, not bad. The gap now between us and Hearts. So, it's... Uh, whatchamacallit, itchy bum time. We're going to hang on. There's another highlight straight from kickoff. Boyle. Cross it in the box. Somebody. Get rid of it. Tackled. Oh no. Still. Free kick. <whistles> Another highlight. Boyle. Pace. Crosses it in there. Carson collects. Running out of time now. Do we have enough in the tank? Stokes. Punts it long. Come on, ref. Blow up. Blow up, I said. Hepper Murphy now. Holds it up. Boyle. There it is. That's full time whistle. Indeed. So that result puts us in fifth place. I think we were still in fifth place before, but it closes the gap to Hearts to just one point. So our next match of the video is a home match at Easter Road up against Dundee. So Dundee currently find themselves in eighth spot. We are in fifth, just one point behind Hearts. So a couple of days have passed. Um, no fresh injuries. In fact, a couple of players have come back to fitness. So this is the new lineup for this match. Marciano, Stevenson, Hanlon, Erkstrom, Ambrose, McGinn, McGow, Ajara, Barker, Swanson, and Murray. So our visitors are going with a 4-2-3-1 formation. Let's do it. Kick us off the game. Swanson with an early free kick. Erkstrom with a header. Throwing for Hibbs, McGow, Jara, Ambrose. Oh, bad deflection. But we get away with it. Jara with a snapshot. 15 minutes gone. Free kick. It, I don't know who got the last touch. Danny Swanson there. And we're in front. Begin with this free kick, lightly floated in. Barker with a header. Murray had a touch of it. it. Everyone, pretty much everybody on that pitch had a touch of that got uh, that ball. But Swanson got the final one. But here come Dundee with their own free kick. But it amounts to nothing. Currently, I don't want to big this up too much because it's well early in the season. But we are currently third. Not bad effort. But here come Dundee again. Oh, makes Marciano save. Pushes out for a corner. And here comes that corner. Headed clear by Barker. Another attempt, though, by Dundee McKenzie. Makes Marciano stretch, but we're doing okay at the moment. A big kick by the Dundee keeper into Swanson. who has been phenomenal since he's come in. He bitched and moaned about getting some game time, and he's not blown it. Ajara! And here come Dundee. Big tackle by McGinn. Hibbs can try and clean up from the back here. Swanson dances around his opponent. Murray with the finish. This is like watching, I wouldn't say Barcelona, but it's like watching uh, maybe Atletico Madrid in Spain. Yeah. We're, 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 we're doing all right, but we're not doing amazing. But here we go again. Ambrose, Ajara, McGow over the top, trying to get Murray, but uh, no. Erkstrand back to the keeper. Hanlon to Swanson. 
little Bobby Dazzler trying to trick his way through. But here come Dundee. Amaru's on his own. Keeper parries it. Mackenzie keeps it alive, but Marciano to collect. Uh, come here, they come again. Dundee. Allen with a long distance shot. Marciano stretches, but doesn't get a touch on it. And there's the halftime whistle doing doing the biz thus far. You know, I'm not going to go all nuts about the performance because still 45 minutes to go. Anything can happen. But at the moment, why would I change my front three? Murray's scoring. Swanson's been amazing. Barker's doing doing some doing the business. I'd say the Barker's probably the weakest of the three. And he is a lone E, so I'm not really too fussed about that. So I might throw in Stokes the last 20 minutes. Yeah, let's see how that pans out the last 20 odd minutes. Another carbon copy free kick, pretty much. Oh, ball's in the net, but it's uh, ruled out. And again, from the same side. Big snapshot by O'Hara. Uh, that reminds me. There are a couple of I want to try and find some Billy Bargains out there to maybe strengthen the squad. Um, I don't have much money. I kind of blew it all on, on Windus. Um, so I'm, I'm going to be trying to... If you've got any suggestions... If you're watching this and you've got any suggestions for any cheap players, uh, let me know. I'm, I need... I'd like to get some more depth in the squad. Obviously, the transfer window is closed. Murray to Stokes. Just to, uh, he's, he's supposed to be our main man, Stokes. But obviously, he's not, not performing for me at the moment. His only real showing was the game against Celtic. Where he had scored two goals. Oh my gosh. Marciano kept that out with his fingertips. And here comes Murray now. Switches play, but nobody's on the same wavelength. But creep and crawl to the, fi the final whistle, maybe? Last highlight, surely. Over the top. Leach Smith. There it is. Two for two, people. Don't want to get excited, but it's hard to stop. There we go, folks. We've got one more game in this uh, in this video. And we currently find ourselves in third spot. So we can't go any higher. But obviously we could drop to as low as sixth. So uh, much to do. So the last match for this video is up against bottom club St. Johnston. We've already taken him on one time already. Pick up a 2-1 victory. Win this is only goal. So... A couple of changes. Ajar is going to be up left. Barker up right. Murray, McTominay, McGow, McGinn. At the back four, Stevenson, Hamlin, Oakstrand, Ambrose, and Ladlaw between the sticks. This has been moaning. Let's jump in. Our visitors, St. Johnson with 4 4 2. And let's get this game underway. Early ball into Ladlaw. Nice and composed. Nothing's going to change in the top two spots for this uh, result. Looks like the title will go to someone in Glasgow, whether it be Celtic or Rangers. Free kick by St. Johnson amounts to nothing. And thus far, we've not really been in this game. Here we are, though. Ambrose, Baker. Blows it, and here comes St. Johnson. I think with a shot, bad law with the save. There's a corner, big effort. It's in the goal. Oh, wait, it's off five. Thank heavens. We'll get Stokes possible as an option from the bench. I don't think these guys are up for it today. Here they come again. Super Jays from McTominay has it. Ajara switches play. Miguel Barker now. Miguel McTominay looking for Murray. Big effort, but uh, no joy. Half time whistle just blown. We've not we've not done anything. So second half. Are we a second half team? Let's find out. Right, I'm going to give it uh, 60 minutes before reeking in some changes. It's danced in the middle there. McTominay has the last effort, but nothing. Really amounts to absolutely nothing. 
throw in from St. Johnston to Davidson. Adelaine, I think that's how you pronounce his name, on loan from Arsenal. 60 minute mark. We're at home. Thirty minutes left in the game. What's left? What have Hibs got in the tank? Can we do it? Can we? If, if we get a win here, it would be a perfect. Oh my goodness! I I was going to say something, but oh, that's just woeful. Come on, boys! Straight from kickoff, please. Ajara McGinn. Stevenson keeps it in. Ajara, Murray, now out left. Boyle. Ambrose overlap. Boyle, cross it in the... Oh, Murray with... I think it was Murray with an effort, but up and over. Still third in the table. Stokes brought down. Surely he's got to go. They're down to ten men. McGinn, Ambrose, Stokes... Forces a corner. I've gone overload. Corner of Hibs once again. Back to back corners. Can we get an equaliser right now? We just need the equaliser. Come on, people. McGinn, McGow, Stevenson. Also on a yellow. Anything left? Anything. Boyle, Ambrose, what was that? What was that? That was such a bad effort. They went out for a throw-in, a deep throw-in. Last couple of minutes, it looks like if anyone's going to score, it's going to be St. Johnston. Head to clear. There's a second, it's over. Over. Uh, nightmare end. To the save. Unless we can. No, nope, not with shooting like that. Oh dear. Despite up against 10 men for the last chunk of the game, we could not find the goals. Ah well. I will uh, fire off a bit of a nasty team talk. Anyway, you win some, lose some. In fact, well, look at that. Crap sticks. So that result leaves us in fourth place. Uh, one point and one place better off than Hearts, but who have a game in hand on us. So in the next video, it will be Hamilton, Partick, and it will be Celtic. If you've enjoyed this video, you might want to check out my other two game saves. Glory on the Rhine featuring Schalke and Nulfia, and Reach for the Summit featuring Real Sociedad. Until next time, thumbs up, subscribe, ciao for now.